Yo, yo, yo. It's time. It's time to check out B.I.'s second album, Cosmos, right now. Now, as y'all know, we have seen the Keep the Fire Alive video. If you guys haven't seen our reaction to that, make sure you find it down below in the description, y'all. Along with other B.I. reactions in a playlist. So, as y'all know, we've already heard parts of Alive and Flame. But we will be running these back to see what we missed in the full version of the song. But I'm not going to get into the intricacies of what we've already heard. But I'm dumb excited. Because Keep the Fire Alive has been like my motivational video for the past few months, man. Like I watched that video and it just it gets me so hyped up. I'm just ready to take on the world. And B.I.'s energy in that, it's just so infectious. Mm. But hold up, first, I think I gotta do it to him. Should I do it to him? Yeah. I gotta shout out the gang, the family, the crew, you, the critiquer. Click, click. Kim Hanbin's second studio album, Cosmos, kicks off with the track, Alive. We'll be using the genius English translations. Let's dive. Yay! I'm alive. The tone of the instrumental in the opening with the piano, it sounds very melancholy. But then it transitions into a hip hop more aggressive beat. So, B.I. is trying to show you that he's moving on from Waterfall. This is the perfect transition from Waterfall into this next album. And he's trying to say that sadness turns into madness and turns into anger and turns into a fire that makes him feel alive. Like, all of this pain makes him feel alive. Yay. I'm alive. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, hey, hey. I feel alive. Hey. I'm alive. Still alive. I feel alive. I'm alive. Still alive. Okay, so up to this moment, we've already heard this. This whole first verse in the hook is in Keep the Fire Alive. So if you guys want to see what we felt about that, just check out that reaction. But let's keep this going, man. I think this verse here we haven't heard yet. But I do want to say that it's highly impressive, his passion. Like, you just feel it in his delivery. You can tell how serious he is. Like, he came into this verse just on fire. Just pure flames, bro. <laughs> Like he's ready to explode. I can feel it. I feel alive. I'm alive. Still alive. Young and stupid booty, chico, bojan, dream, huh? 
출발선을 넘은 순간 나나 무이 도와줄 거 아니면 그냥 이 보물여 익명성은 무지한 자들의 무기 주관적인 생각에 깊은 너 개인에게 성을 받기 하나 벌써 내가 원하는 건 참도 너부터 해방 Come on back from hell Life is in the world 둘이 타 올라가면서 라 있음을 느껴 I feel Check the cadence, bro. He's the back flow. From hell. That was nasty. Like. <laughs> He's talking about them haters that are talking shit online. Yeah, because he said. He's saying that this could destroy people's personality. Like, yeah. You got. You can't just be messing with. He's speaking real facts right here. Anonymity is the weapon of the ignorant. So he's he's talking shit right to all of those haters that use anonymous accounts that like to troll and talk trash. And that's why you have to be anonymous because you're ignorant. Yeah, right. You're just spewing stuff. You don't even know right. what you're talking about. You're not going to put your face on that. The objectification of subjective thoughts. So like your personal opinions don't really matter, but you act like... Like, your personal opinions are facts or something. Right. But they're just your opinion. Right. And because... They don't hold merit. Everybody has these opinions. Sometimes these opinions destroy people's personality. Because they think, oh, people don't like when I do this, so I'm not going to do that anymore. So they change themselves based upon how other people feel about them. But... He's saying, like, that destroys personality. That just makes you like everybody else. So now to people, please. nobody's being individuals anymore. People are just, yeah, people pleasing. You're just put in that box of what's okay, what's right. And yeah. What box is that, you know? Who made that box? He just wants a sense of freedom from people trying to meddle into his life and tell him what's right and wrong, what he should be doing or shouldn't be doing. Right. Like, he just let that get to him for a while, probably. He let that make him become a people pleaser. Mm -hmm. And now he's like, no, nah, I'm done with that. Because I feel says, like I'm I lost a part of myself. And he said, I'm back from hell. Life is a nor. Noir. 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 I thought it was now. <laughs> it's not it's now. Yeah, I think it's noir. Noir, noir right? Mm -hmm. um, so he's saying, life is dark. So he's back from hell, as in... He's like the devil because of everybody's opinions about him. All of their negative opinions. He's saying, okay, well, I guess I'm from hell. I'm back from hell. Life is a dark place. And I like how he says young and stupid. Let's bump into each other. Like, you know, saying that cyber bullies, they team up together. Trolls. Right. And they're just dumb. <laughs> like, right. they, you know, they, they're just like, let's be dumb together. Right. And talk about things that we have no idea what we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. What? Like, the way that he used, huh? Like, you know, that's, that's a sound that everybody's accustomed to. Everybody's heard somebody go, huh? And he's taking Korean words and pronouncing it like that. Like, ooh, careful. Like, ooh, huh. Like, that's so cool, bro. And then he's actually saying, huh, in the, in the background. Taking a familiar sound or a familiar nursery rhyme melody is such a genius thing to do. Like, I always appreciate that when an artist does that.
Now, for me, when I heard how the instrumentation came like full circle in the song, where it came back to like a melancholy place, it's like that feeling of feeling alive because of all the pain is like in between the pain. It's like you feel the pain and then you feel alive and then you feel the pain again. The pain comes back, the sadness. And I just feel like Alive is the perfect intro track because it fits perfect with the times. Like he just almost went to jail for the dumbest reasons. So for him to say, you know, I'm still alive. You know, all this pain keeps me, makes me feel like I'm alive. Like I just felt like that was perfect because it's so relatable and it also makes you feel for him and it's just the perfect transition from waterfall into this new album i'm excited 19. now this is the live clip he also has a live that i seen on the grammys website i just looked up to see when the grammys are and then i seen that hey here look uh watch bi's 19 live i'm like what this is crazy i was so hyped to see that so we'll check out this live clip and then we'll check out the other live clip that's for the grammys let's stuff skate park okay we got rockstar bi electric guitar what's going on Uh. Yo, this is mm, like sound is amazing. Nice. Like the the first line he says, "Leave me alone." Mm -hmm. That ties in perfectly with that last verse on the live. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yo, I relate so hard to everything he's saying. And bro, this green screen is just giving me like yeah. 90s, 2000s vibes. Yeah, this is I entertaining. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, please don't judge them for being adults who have already lost their burning passion because they're complaining about everything. Mm -hmm. Ooh, burn, bro, damn. <laughs> this is dope right here. That's facts, though. Like, adults that complain about everything, it's because they don't have a passion. Either they dropped their passion and they yep. gave up on that, or them. they don't have one. <laughs> Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this this concept though. Ooh, that melody. Now it's that's like the Matrix. 
<laughs> yeah, what is the going on? The stormtrooper in the background, like. That's facts. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. That's relatable, bro. Damn. I stop holding celebrities to the highest of high God standard. God standard. They don't do any wrong. Like they're not. They're people, bro. They're just making music. Love the vocals. Yeah. Hey. song that was really impressive wow dude wow i mean i'm, I'm not you don't even need to like break this down it's I'm like not surprised. so obvious what it means the way he's just like i don't want to become an adult another sad adult like he's dissing he's low-key dissing the people that are judging him at the same time while right. saying i don't want to be right i don't want to be become them. one of you <laughs> <laughs> like how many people can relate to the things he said like He's speaking nothing but facts, man. Yeah. The flow. Honestly, sometimes adults are bitter because of falling in love too deeply. Right. And that's another reason why they just sit around and complain, and, complain and judge people. Yeah, because they're yep. just mad about yep. their own lives. That's another reason or, why adults... Or having a bunch of responsibilities. Will be bitter. You know? Yeah. Like, you know, you have kids or whatever. He's saying he doesn't want to be that. He doesn't want to be a sad adult because of the responsibilities or falling in love too deep. That's bitter that hurt. they're not a teenager anymore. Yeah, he wants to stay 19. How many people can relate to that, bro? I love this. What is love? There is a cruelty in its beauty. Only God knows if it's a curse or a blessing. Can't tell the difference. Can't tell the difference between humans and robots these days. Like, are you even yourself, or are you just what you think you should be? Are you just a bot? Yeah, a bot. Yeah, just doing what every everybody else does. Yeah, fitting in with the trends even is like such a robot thing to do, in my opinion. It's gross. To like always have to be on trend you just know do yeah just, just do what you like want to do everybody everybody likes and it's so gross like that's what makes trends and things right. is like when people are like hey i'm gonna be different and start something new right and then other people follow you that's cool you that's know? called being a leader yeah 
Bullshit, they want more money. Beyond what I got, the pack of good hood, I'm a job of Montana. Sad, I'm dead and done. Money, you're my job, I'm not a kid, I'm 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 a kid, you know, right. he realizes that he might lose some fans. He realizes that some people might judge him and look down on him, but he's not going to change who he is. So far in this album, it just seems like nothing but middle fingers up, baby. Nothing but middle fingers up. <laughs> Basically, by saying he wants to become a bird and throw himself into the clouds, is like I want to be so I want to be free and be so high up in my own positivity and feeling good that i don't even see y'all like y'all are yeah. down there y'all are down there i can't see y'all i'm in the clouds i'm having fun i'm being me the versatility man you got bi walking through a storm and then you got people talking about it, tweeting about it, posting stuff on the internet. Yep. That's a good song. That's written beautifully. Yes. Of course. I mean, of course. No what doubt. Else, what else did I expect? All right. Let's Grammy go. boy. Let's go. Let's get it. I really like that performance. I love seeing Soul in the background here. And his casual swag mixed with like a pinch of emotion. Like a pinch of, you know, being sick of what everybody thinks about me. Like you, you felt that. He conveyed that well. And it was beautiful. Beautiful performance. Yes. Such a professional.